Hey you guys, I'm back with another vlog. I am going to Target. <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy my life, okay? I will not let A-Days ruin me. So I'm gonna go to Target. I need a few things. Honestly, I'm really just going to Target for therapeutic reasons. So, I mean, there's really no rhyme. There's really no reason. We'll see I'm here for therapeutic reasons. So, let's put on some NYX lip oil because it's so pretty and it's really cute even without makeup. It's a really cute tint. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Can I just add that I have like a Stanley cup? Oh my gosh, wait. I actually have some hot tea in here. I'm going to take a sip of this. I'm not going to bring with me because honestly, I might. I don't know. I'm not a professional Stanley cupper. So, whoa, that's hot. I'm just going to let this cool down. I just feel like every time I see these NYX lip oils, I have to get one. So right now I have this one, this flavor, and I don't know, like this one is really giving, but then I don't really like the shimmers, so no. Clear, it's kind of basic. Maybe this one, maybe I'll try this one. You guys, oh my God, do I need it? I think I do. Hey you guys, so tomorrow I'm going to Atlanta. Tomorrow I'm going to Atlanta to get my first laser treatment done to remove my microbladed eyebrows. I was kind of hesitant on whether or not I'm going to share this journey with you guys, but why not? I don't see a lot of black women actually going to get their I don't see a lot of black women actually documenting their microblading removal journey. So I wanted to be that. So if, you know, for some reason you are that individual, you can follow my journey. So I'm going to vlog that and yeah. restaurant 
but I'm just you know I'm just so happy to be off like I have to really train my mind on like getting out of work mode because even though you're off work even though I'm off work sometimes I don't feel like I'm off work like my mind has to catch up to reality <laughs> the reality is that I don't have to work tomorrow so anyway this is my second official time going out in Boston I'm gonna let you guys see my view it's freezing it's currently freezing and I'm going to get some Mexican food because I'm determined to live my life <laughs> That food was super yummy. I was thinking to myself while I was eating, I'm like, <laughs> is it normal to feel this comfortable being alone? <laughs> so <clears throat> I was just sitting here thinking, right? Um, I have lived in the South for so long. And now that I live in the Northern part of America, I just love how different the vibe is out here. Like the restaurant that I just went to, I saw like an Asian couple and you know, they were on a date at like a small little Mexican restaurant hole in the wall. And you know, they were just vibing. And I really loved that. And I was like, out in my head, I was picturing how their night is gonna go. Like, oh, they're gonna hit, they hit up their favorite Mexican spot. It got burrito tacos, then went home and probably like, you know, put on some jazz music. And people are watching me vlog right now and I feel hella freaking awkward. It was really good. I'm so glad that I'm off work. I'm so glad that I have the day off tomorrow and the day after that. And I'm really getting my mind into rest mode. So. Yeah.